hello viewers welcome to my channel today i'm going to show you how to trade with candlestick psychology so you are requested to stay with me till an end without skip oh before going to start i have a request please subscribe the channel by click the button if you didn't subscribe yet and thank you all who have already subscribed hello traders Welcome back to my channel. So let's find some candle to trade. This is Euro USD and there is no proper moment. Okay, I'm going with sellers from this level. Though this is a uh, strong candle with lower rejection, but I can see that candle close at the sellers area. From this area, you can see some sellers entry and this is uh, SNR level. It means uh, sellers will take advantage from this level. That's what I placed a uh, layer option. Okay. See if you check this. This is area buyer's entry, seller's entry, buyer's entry. Okay. Again, buyer's entry and control close at the level. Okay. Okay, okay, I'll place her up from here, but it should be it's closer to opening price. Uh, I might missing this trade. Okay, I'll wait because if I place trade here, it might be late entry. I supposed to place here. Okay, so strong sellers entry. I'm going with sellers. Okay, I have placed lawyer up front because of this strong seller entry after uh, struggling in this area. And there is no any level to go with buyers too. <clears throat> Sorry. Okay, I'm going with buyers. Uh, little late entry. Okay, I have placed higher option here because that candle just broke this uh, round number. So, uh, this uh, should be a retest candle also. Uh, uh, you can check this is a bar entry point. If you mark this point, like this is an area where actually buyers enter several times. Buyers entry, buyers entry, buyers entry, again buyers entry. And this this was also see retraced by uh, some sellers. It means always you should uh, place a uh, higher option here even if you lose. Uh, some trade you might lose uh, and that is okay. Uh, you may lose some trade even after uh, proper analyze. See, there are strong sellers but buyers entry because of level, because of these buyers, because of these buyers. Okay. So by this way, you can place trade and don't trade too much. Always try to place less trade. Okay, as much as you can. And wait for right moment to place trade. I'll try to place on more trade if I have good confirmation.
no creo. No, level broken. But it can be another bullish. That's what I'll not place trade here. And mostly it will be bearish, but I, uh, there is a confusion, so I'll avoid this candle. Okay, so let's check another pairs. Uh, this is an extreme level, but it has been broken. So no. Okay, I'll place your higher option. Okay, I placed your uh, late entry. Okay. I placed higher option uh, because of this buyer entry. This is a buyer entry point. I mean, candle close at the buyer area, but this is little late entry because of uh, uh, some buyer entry suddenly uh, as soon as open that candle. So, always try to find some good candle to trade. And don't hurry when you trade. Okay. So this is also an trade, <clears throat> and yeah. if you check, uh, this is my first trade. I have started with twenty eight dollars. Uh, here I have placed lawyer option because uh, I saw that candle uh, candle close at the uh, sellers area. Though there uh, the candle has uh, buyers uh, entry uh, uh, rejection from this level, but candle close at the uh, sellers area. Uh, with small rejection it means next candle uh, uh, supposed to be a bearish candle uh, that's what i have placed lawyer option this is my second trade i placed lawyer option here because i saw that level has been uh, broken by this candle and very strong seller entry from this level uh, here actually trying to make uh, some trend but it failed uh, see this is high again tried but failed again tried but suddenly seller sent it means uh, uh, buyers are not interested at this area that's what i have placed uh, lawyer option this is my third trade after that candle i have placed higher option here even after uh, two strong seller entry because that candle close at the uh, buyers area so it's not good to go uh, um, against this buyer okay even if you lost, sometime you may lose, sometime may uh, close as a small bearish candle or a small bullish candle. So it can happen sometimes, but most of the time you will win this trade uh, when you see this situation. I have uh, tested a lot of time. Okay. And this is my fourth trade, absence pair uh, here, this uh, USD card. And I have placed here a uh, higher option because I saw uh, so many rejection in this area. Uh, it means this is a strong uh, buyer's entry point. As soon as uh, market went up, back and from this level, see a lot of buyer's entry, a lot of buyer's entry. So candle close at the uh, buyer's area. Even this is a strong candle and engulfing uh, pattern, but still I placed because see, if you see this is a strong candle, but market, strong candle, market reverse strong candle market reverse okay so strong candle uh, not like every time uh, market will continue uh, you need to check where the candle form and with some other uh, uh, information that you will get while market is running see if you check this candle now what happening in this candle you will understand okay and based on that uh, this you need to 
decide for next trade so uh, thanks for enjoying this video please make a thumbs up uh, if you uh, like this video and share this video with your friend uh, really, uh, I need some inspiration from all of you to make a new video every day with new concept thank you so much